dog back again okay so um evidently it's still ziggy takeover time Ooh. so what we've got here we've got a whole load of lego oh this lego is going to be fascinating oh my god uh yeah anyway it is going to be fascinating because this big pile of lego which has been keeps being moved from one place to another place moved to another place moved to another place has not been dealt with it's been unwrapped taken out of the box and then it just keeps getting moved so it's getting washed um i've got my stuff here ready um it's gonna there are some cool bits in it um this was from it yeah so we know that we've got some castle bits in here um i can see yeah. horses more castle stuff there are some castle walls there's one there castle wall so there are some good stuff in here but there is a lot of techniques we don't like techniques but other people do and it sells so if we're going to resell we've got to do it not the best but you know we've got to go with you know what's happening um we've also got so that's from 1950s that's the part of a tailgate so that's a good positive but those last ones that we have we haven't actually put together and then i've got this here which i'm not allowed to touch because this is dirty and it's probably got like bugs in it or something so that's got to go in we're not looking at that there's space bits in there for a spaceship but so all of this is going to like go with stuff that we need i know that there's a space bit in there um i'm not supposed to be touching it uh, but it, it, yeah so we've got like again 1950s bits in here but it's just going to go in the mix with it because i'm expecting to see um that space but there's a there's there's another there on the picture there was we haven't looked yet um but it's also got crud in it it's probably gonna have loads of plain deal which isn't the best um and then for some reason this hasn't been opened it's it says it, it's still you know it's got the collection thing on it uh, but it's not been opened so we're gonna crack into this i uh, don't really know how um may i have some assistance please um i need to get into this parcel hello mm. you can help me eh? <coughs> <clears throat> yeah, I'm doing it, I'm doing it, I'm opening it, I'm opening it now. I'm doing it. Yeah. Don't let me stop you, JC Lully. What's this like? Okay, this is what this is what we were expecting. Um I am a bit annoyed because if I was to send this off, I wouldn't you just send it in a monkey like bendy bar bendy bag and um, who cares if it's got bubbles in it so these break um but not this time so you know the hazard was avoided uh, so this is um space board um i think we've actually run out of these because we we have made a lot of the sets with these they usually go to australia or canada uh, so that would be helpful um, we can probably just make a, a supply base. I think we've got pieces for that. And then, so kindly, put everything into bags. So it is just some basic Lego pieces, some basic bits. We need a post box because we've run out of post boxes. Um, we've got Lego piece there. This only costs like £10, I think, this lot. A few, like, little... parts that we can use just some basic things just ten a penny really i think it was because it went cheap and we could have done with the baseboard that's why we went with that right so i've got to get on with washing now <sighs> so we're just going to put in a little bit of disinfectant um a little bit of uh, fairy liquid uh, washing detergent, no advertising here. 
and maybe a little bit of the nice bleach but I have to stay away from that because I don't want to get patchy uh, so we've got, our, we've got our tub there so we're going to put it in our tub over there let's go let's do it okay here we are uh, so it's been um, cleaned um, it's been out overnight now um, this is my colander I've rinsed this one through yeah. oh. it's a bit wet still it's drying out we've got some good pieces yet we have we've got um, we got knights black knights black falcon knights that is um, looks like might have ice cream van or if we're lucky we might find the snack bar sign in here which is slightly better set that's a good thing because that's part of the Weetabix house um, and we can always do with doing another Weetabix house um, we've got that that's for uh, an auto repair shop be good if we can do that I'm not sure if we've got the correct base paint but we can always look and see what we've got there uh, and that's this piece here that's the piece that I was looking for for my space set so glad to see you okay so I've got a lot of sorting to do um, we'll probably put out the mat and <sighs> it's going to need a bit more drying to be honest um, so this is a long task ahead of me so let's go roll the tape So, it's all sorted um, and it is looking good, it is looking good. Um, so, as I was telling you, lots and lots of techniques. So, what we've worked out is this wheel, we've only got three of them. Bit of a nuisance, bit of a nuisance. So we've got three of these wheels. We've we've ordered another one on eBay. Um, we would use Bricklink if if it was not if it was better than it is. Um, but yeah, we've ordered another one of them because this is from um, Test Car Technics. 8865 test car which we've looked up and it's going for around the 80 region um some people i mean they're asking this is a so they've got the box they've got the instruction and they're asking uh 
around the 500 to 600 pound mark for this set that this wheel comes from um i don't think that's realistic obviously we don't have any of the instructions uh so we can't charge <laughs> i'm not going to charge it anyway we're going to charge um 80 pounds for ours well maybe a little less so but i mean first we've got to we've got to go through all of this and see if we've got it but i shouldn't see any issue um this is probably going to be like one of the rarer parts um and we've got absolutely loads of these Ooh, yeah i mean how many are there here my goodness i remember we needed this for the western set um, we needed this part for the western set and we had to order it <laughs> we had to order the part in <laughs> in this one we've ended up with loads I reckon there's more under there yeah th there's more there's absolutely loads of them absolutely loads of them so that's a good whizzer oh, and so this I was so happy Ooh, I've dropped it Ooh. okay hang on I'll put it on my face. I'll put it on my face. So this part here, which you can see, is a shield. Um, let me just fetch you this one. So this, this is what it looks like in grey. And that's, this is the transparent piece. This only goes with one set called um mobile uh, mobile something or other mobile tracking thing uh, so anyway you need two of these to do for one set so we've only got one uh last time we had this uh we sold the set we got we got the original box for it and we sold it for 80 pounds it went to australia and it was an easy 80 pounds so i'm going to make that set up just with uh the one um shield on top and we'll try for like 50 or 60 for that so that one piece i could sell that one piece on its own for around 25 on its own so bonus uh the main job lot that we've got here we spent 30 pounds on uh no we spent we spent 40 pounds with the postage because it was heavy um right okay what else have we got let's move the camera let's move the camera okay so this this set here so this has been knocking around this has been in our spares so you can see what that is it's a basic spaceship um and that is what i needed this part for so I needed another one of them to complete that so I can now build that set so that's great um, the job lots also come with this uh, jet uh, pack thing jet thing rocket accessory that, that's part of this set so we could start putting some bits aside for another one um, we've also got lots of other space sets that we can do um i've seen that we've got this whoops i'm not very good at holding lego oh geez uh yeah we've got this hat here so from what i can see uh we can make this set um which we are actually lucky enough to have the box for and as you can see on the back there that's where that shield comes from um one of the other interesting things that we've got here so this is the color of the swords which are part of the castle but we've also got the lighter colored swords which are actually from the original from the late 70s so that's a bonus to find them because then we can start putting them aside for if we start doing the yellow castle again um, which would be nice if we could do that so we've got lots of shields as well um we've got a number of these taps these go um 
Let me put my face in front of it. So that goes on another space set, but I don't think we've got all the parts for here. God, what else have we got? Um, this is interesting. I don't think I'm going to get much money for it, but we've got two of these, um, which obviously are level crossing things. Um, and I've been looking through the brochure and there is the level crossing barrier on there. So I'll sell them. Oh, what else have I got? What else have I got? Uh, I'm going to do the siege tower. So this is a castle set. Um, I know that we've got the siege tower in here because we've got a few castle walls, but only a few castle walls. Uh, but we've got this ladder. And now usually these ladders are grey, but this one is brown. So I know that we've got the siege tower. So we're going to build that. Um, there's other Technic sets here. I think we've got the Umatic set because we've got this but I think there's other parts that go with this so we'll see what we can find in relation to that um oh yeah there's various other vintage parts here that's from a castle set obviously we've got all of these castle figures that are here um then this is a rarity but it's been broken you can see there it's been broken so although that's a rarity in 1960 set it doesn't really help us we've got a few of these older parts which haven't got the lipped bit at the bottom so that's a bonus for some because we haven't been able to build some of the other sets i've got a load of these which are space sets um, there is one called the mobile lab and you can see there on the back um, that's the same piece so I'm going to build that because I've got the instructions for it um, and what else have I got oh yes um, I think we've got this yes I think we've got that um, because I believe this part which is a space part and i would rather put it with a space set um but we do have the instructions for this and i know that this the reason that this instruction is still hanging around um is because it needs this so we may as well do that one because we've got the instructions so that's what i'm working on i've got a few more lego sets um lego instruction things here which i'm going to have a look at see if i can do them but Without further gabbing on, I'm going to do some building. <laughs> Let's do this. This is editing Viggy. Viggy? <laughs> this is editing Ziggy. Um, yeah, there's going to have to be a part two of this video because I have no idea what's going on between Canva and Clipchamp and all these other three free editing video softwares. They're all bloody useless. Check this out. Check this out. 
probably got like bugs in it or something. So that's got to go in. We're not looking at that. There's space bits in there for a spaceship. But so all of this is going to like go with stuff that we need. I know that there's a space bit in there. Um, this video is not right. I'm all, I'm all shaky and weird. So I'm going to try and do some further editing and then I, I think it's because I've gone over 30 minutes. Anyway, there's going to be a part two. Go to part two now. Go, go, go. Weird. That space.